hi guys welcome back to another video it's your girl alicia D here if you're new welcome and thank you so much for joining my channel um so the returning subscribers welcome back guys thank you so much for being there for me so in today's video it's um a video on how to prepare herrero bread if you're not a herrero and if you are not a herrero and you want to challenge me on how to prepare come on challenge accepted let's get right into this video i'm so excited you guys um So I have already made a, uh, a video on how to prepare Herrero bread um, But I don't know why you guys keep on asking the same question. How do I do this? Why? Um, how my bread is not coming out the way I want and all that so I think in today when I did the video it was them first days of YouTube so I, I was a bit nervous I didn't explain I didn't go much into details so in today's video I'm gonna try my best and explain to you guys I'm really sorry for the background Destiny and Denzel are here in the kitchen with me they are far and not close to where I'm preparing so yeah if you hear any noise, can you forgive me? You know, when you're a mother, you will experience that. <laughs> Anyways, so let's get right into this video. I'm really excited, you guys. Let's go. Let me show you my ingredients. So, I don't know if it's just me or anyone else. When I'm preparing, Food or when I'm cleaning I prefer listening to music so that's what I'm doing right now I have my box here and I have Denzel tablet Denzel you're making noise so let's go to the ingredients so in today's video I'm going to be using two of this if you want you can just measure with um, with a normal spoon um, and I have the virgin oil huh? yeah extra virgin olive oil I have my salt here I have the baking flour mine is plain you can use ready um, self rice if you're using that self rice you don't need any of this but if you want, you can just put a little. Then so you're making noise. So I have my butter here. It's not much. Yeah, anyways. Um, so in here, I have my sugar. And I'm going to use this part. Um, I think I forgot to take out the other one. One sec. I'll be using that as well um let me get the other thing so i have my mixing bowl here so the very first thing denzel you're making noise so the very first thing that you need to do keep keep it in mind the very first thing that you need to do before mixing everything just turn on turn on your micro uh, microwave your oven so because we are not cooking we just want the oven to to be warm so i'm gonna put it at 100 and this side because ovens are different i don't know which one is yours so but just make sure it's not it's not any anywhere here it's just around 50 something there yeah so I'm gonna go ahead and start with the process. 
I left this one, so I'm gonna gonna start with this one. So when it comes to the salt, you just need one teaspoon, and when it comes to sugar, it's really how you want it. So you can use boiled water, but in my case, I, in my situation, I'm going to use just normal tap water, but I open the hot side. I don't want it to be very hot. Okay, so you guys, what you need to do is concentrate on your water. You don't really need to put a lot of water, just put little by little so you can stay. You don't want your your shanty to be too um, heavy. Yeah, so let's do that. Let's start with the process, mixing process. So what you need to do next, you're going to take your butter, excuse me. So you need to do this little bowl. It should be five or six or any. I, I, I think as long as there's like the little part in between. I'll show you what I mean. If you are not, if you don't know how to prepare. So I have my bread ready as you guys saw. Um, let's go ahead and put it in the oven. It's nice and warm. Let's go ahead and tidy up my mess. I'm gonna warm this up. So let's go ahead and, and tidy up all this mess. Let me dance for you guys. Yeah. So Hey. 
<laughs> it's a joke. So um, I'll be using this. guys this really didn't take not even 30 minutes it was so fast so i'm gonna go ahead and sort out my baby and then by the time i'm finished with breastfeeding um should be ready for cooking so now that we are starting to to prepare our bread we are slowly turning it on. Um, mine is at 150. Yeah, 150, so I'll try and control it there. Looking good. Looking good. Gonna do it. My so the main reason why I spray my bread is that I want it to be so soft, you know. Yummy. Okay, let's see. Together, we don't get tired. Mm. 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 M